Rob Macchio defends the Valiant Cobra Kai, but in real life he's defending Karate Kid from critics saying it's not diverse enough. Explain this, for 40 years Karate Kid has had criticism for having a new entirely white cast. Which does make some sense seeing how the movie does take place in Los Angeles, but despite having a 49% Hispanic population, there's no Hispanic people in the movie. The other criticism is the movie, despite being called Karate Kid, only has one Asian actor in the movie with Pat Morita as Mr. Miyagi. Rob Macchio addressed this saying he believes the opposite, saying Karate Kid pays homage to Japanese American culture. Pointing out how Karate Kid is one of the only movies ever made that addresses the Japanese internment. The Japanese internment happened after Pearl Harbor where FDR wrongly decided to put 120,000 Japanese Americans into internment camps. Mr. Miyagi actor Pat Morita was one of those 120,000 people spending two years inside the internment camps. Ralph Macchio said the producers didn't want the Japanese internment mentioned originally, but the team bought it and when the producers saw the final cut they agreed to let it stay in. It should be noted the Karate Kid 2 cast only had one white actor with Ralph Macchio. Way to go sensei and with that I'm Charles Peralo, please subscribe.